Hey lightweights and welcome back to some more Red Dead Redemption 2. Last video, last couple videos have been super emotional. Um, we found out that Arthur has TB last episode. Um, I took it really hard. <laughs> uh, thank you guys for all being so kind. Um, I listened to your advice and I grabbed my box of Kleenex. I'm ready to go. Um, but that being said, I think I'm going to focus on side missions and some smaller exploration type of things this video just for a little break because I don't want to cry <laughs> for at least like a video or two if I can help it. I know I said that last time and it was my famous last words, but um, I really just going to take a break from the main story for a little while and focus on some of those other side things that you guys have spoken so highly of. So I have kind of a rough plan in my head of what I want to get done. Um, I'm going to start off by turning in the rock carvings. I mailed them into the guy we got the mission from off camera, uh, and I have a letter at the post office. I think that's supposed to be from him. So I'm going to start off with that and then kind of work my way through some things. Now, you guys mentioned a lot of stranger missions you want me to accomplish. I'm not going to do all of them in one video. I'm going to pace them out. Um, I know I need to have them done before the end of chapter six, but I really want to try to sprinkle them throughout uh, the chapter. So I'll make sure I get them all done before the end of the chapter, uh, but I'm definitely not going to just do all of them right now. So um, keep leaving your ideas and the, the missions you really want to see in the comments below. I really appreciate that and that feedback, um, but just know I will get to them even if I don't get to them right away. So as always, thank you so much for watching. Please make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit that bell button when you do so that you know when I post the next video because I have a feeling we are going to be in for a wild ride. <laughs> All right, here we go, you guys. All right, so, <laughs> you know how I always joke, like, I'm a professional. Well, I had another one of those moments. Um, <laughs> so I did the final rock carving mission. I ran into some members of the KKK and I did the final mission for the brothers with the waterfall, only to realize my face cam was not recording. So, I wanna keep the footage. Um, it was an hour's worth of recording, so I didn't wanna to have to re-record it for two reasons. One, that's an hour's worth of work done, lost. Two, um, the reactions wouldn't be genuine anymore. So what I'm going to do is put that edited clip at the very end of this video. Um, so you'll have the rest of the video with the face cam camera <laughs> and then I'll cut that part and put it at the very end so that if you are interested in seeing it still, even though you won't be able to see my reactions, you'll just hear them. You can, if you don't really care, um, then you don't need to watch it because it'll be the end of the video. So that's my plan. Um, I just fast traveled to Emerald Ranch because I'm going to go up and see the veteran. Um, so yeah, that's kind of where we are, kind of where we left off. Triple checking that everything is recording. I think we're good to go. So take two of my professional channel. Oops, we're kicking shit now. Do I need guns? Um, just... A stealthy option and a non-stealthy option. Can you help? Can you help me, mister? What's the problem? Hi. My goddamn horse got spooked and run off. Are you hurt? Not too bad, at least. But he took my damn leg. Sorry. He went that way, I think. His name's Buell. Buell? Second time a prick named Buell cost me a leg. Huh? Buell was my general when I lost it. Oh, uh, okay. Anyway, if you see an angry bastard of a horse with my wooden leg, I'd be real grateful. I'll 
Bear that in mind. Okay. Let's go find Buell. Let's go, girl. Probably that, huh? <laughs> Buell! Not dynamite him. Holy shit, could you imagine? That'd be so horrible. Oops. Come okay. here. Hi. Come down. Come down. Hi. Take it easy. Hi. Spooked all right. There. Hey now. So okay. You're a good boy. Here you come. Listen to the soothing Arthur. Come on now. Come here. Here you come. Go okay. Okay, we're um. Really struggling right now. That wiped us out. He's pretty. Look at his eyes. Hey, will you come with me now? This way. Come on. Well, come on, Dan. Let's get you back. There. He's just where you left him. Can't go far with that leg in your stirrup. Can't go bucking him like that. He's uh, talking to good, you hear? I get the notion he's not a man you want to cross. No matter how big and strong you are. He's so sweet, you guys. I could have written Siri over and brought him with me, but this is really Come peaceful. On. You're not so nasty. Hey, look, it's your owner. I found him. You're a good man, Mr. Mr. Arthur. You're right. He's a brute. <laughs> Hamish Sinclair. Yeah, he's a great horse, aside from when the devil got him. <laughs> hey, you want to hand me that leg there, please? And while you're at it, give old Buell a kick for me, would you? No, I'm only kidding. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> or him but a snake that spooked him. <laughs> you're a real gentleman, you know? Sometimes, maybe. Yeah, how'd you lose a leg? Oh, in the war. Cannonball. Oh. Pretty clean, though. I don't have much pain, and I didn't get any gangrene. A young boy went into battle with me, got cut in half, so all things considered, I'm doing pretty well, I guess. Yeah, I guess. So, uh, how is the false one? 
It's okay. <sighs> I can still hunt, fish. Enjoy the outside. I weren't sent too crazy by it. Anyway, I ain't got much to pay you with. You know, that's okay. You like fishing? You can come with me someday. I know some pretty good spots. Uh, I'm a pretty poor fisherman. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I'm great, so between the two of us, we do okay. My cabin is right over on the other side of O'Cray's run there. Thanks again. Now, you throw me again, you old dumb bastard. I'm gonna put a bullet in you. <gasps> you will I'll not. See you again. That was really sweet, you guys. Arthur's such a good guy. Um. I need to get my cores up. How beautiful. We're just gonna sleep. Pretty close to Drogic's house. Now, I know that this is the stranger mission a lot of you asked me to do. I'm not gonna do that this video. I am gonna do it, I promise. But if you notice, I've got lots of stranger missions. I'm going to spread them out a little bit. So we'll do it at some point, I promise. But today is not that day. But let's go visit Dragic, because a lot of you said I need to go back up there. I really want to see if he got his robot working. Yeah. kind of want to talk to him about trying to invent a time machine. And then, yeah. That way we can uh, either go back in time and not contract TV, or go to the future, get a cure, and come back. Right, we're here. Slow it up. Now, if I remember correctly, I have to go in the back door. Why is there a gun? Dragic, what are you up to? Let's put our gun away. Why do we have our gun out? Professor? Where's your creation now? Tragic. Tragic, what happened? Oh my god. Did the robot kill him? Invisible waves, ghost waves, mystery waves, magic waves, waves you cannot see. Oh my god, our bloody footprints are on the ground. It's really disturbing. Poor Dragic, he was so excited. Five years, one automaton, receive funding, win top scientist's prize. Six years, two automatons, make automaton factory. 10 years, 100 automatons, become very rich man. 15 years, automaton army, take over world. Tragic. No. You 
wouldn't. Oh. Here's a chair there. All right. This is really sad. Although if he was actually going to take over the world, you know, probably not a bad thing. But he's dead. I remembered I had to come in the back door. Forgot I had to leave out the back door. Oh no. Can we find the robot? Okay, my girl. Ooh. That's a fucking bear. I didn't even look at the condition of his pelt. I just kind of shot it. Oh, sorry, buddy. But you were probably gonna kill me. Good. <laughs> That's not helpful. Sorry. Skin dia for no reason. says get someplace dry and warm. That is not this place. <sighs> Morning. Morning, Arthur. Karen. <sighs> Morning, Arthur. Glad to be home. I almost wish we were back in Guam. I know. Trust me. Be it fake. Your youthful bloom. It fades. And it's a horror what's left. Don't be like that, Miss Grimshaw. I know how you girls laugh at me. I used to laugh at women just like me when I was young and pretty and sure of the world. We don't laugh at you, miss. You do. And you're right, too. I'm laughable, pitiable, but it'll happen to you, too. They'll stop looking soon enough, and that glass in your hand won't be so friendly, neither. Well, maybe I'll get lucky and die first. Yes. We'll get to work. Vanity won't help you, young or old. Susan.
Mr. Morgan. <laughs> Herr Strauss. How are you? About... About how I look. Okay. <sighs> are you, um... Are you perhaps available for some work? Debtors? Yes. I guess. Your commitment to your duties is admirable. <coughs> you know, Mr. Morgan, you are... Well, I'm sorry for you. Huh? No, never mind. I didn't... Look, Strauss. You take care. I ain't dead yet. No, of course not. That's what I was saying. I... Uh, I... A debtor, Strauss. Who owes you money? Well, there's a deserter from Fort Wallace. Head to him first. They're looking for him out on the road near Three Sisters. Man's name is J. John Weathers. J. John Weathers. Then there's a miner over in Annisburg. He's called... Well, he's called Arthur. <laughs> like you. Huh. <laughs> Arthur Londonderry. Family man, in. desperate, you know the type. Couldn't one of the boys do this? I tried. They lacked your... figure. Figure, huh? huh. All right. Uh, take care, uh, uh, Mr. Morgan. So, <clears throat> there's supposed to be a letter from Penelope. I still haven't gotten it yet. It's kind of why I came back to camp. Arthur. Good morning. So, here we are. I like what you've done with the place. As long as it keeps folk away, I don't care. Well, the stew's not going to be ready for a while. Why is everyone acting so crazy, Morgan? I guess folk are real scared. We'll be fine. We always have been. Now Dutch will see us good. I hope so. Not you as well. Another fella doubting them? You know, I thought... I thought more of you, Morgan! Bill. Use your brain, please. Tilly. Tilly. This sucks, you guys. Arthur getting his flirt on. I never find the door to this damn place. I don't know why. Welcome back. Watch yourself. Oh. Oh. Sweet Jesus, son of a bitch. You did not. I think you have me mistaken, sir. Oh. Give me the money. Yeah. 
I'm not in the mood for this. This is a bad day for you, mister. That's all I took, I swear. Don't kill me. I didn't mean anything, really. Mm-hmm. Jesus! I'll take that. You can stay there. Learn your freaking lesson. Stealing from a dying man. Honestly. Anyways, before I was so rudely interrupted. Welcome back. Change your mind on something? I want to buy another Let's little box. Have a look. Also, I've got like a shit ton of money. So I feel like I should just buy everything. <laughs> Let's buy a secondary one of those. You made a good decision. I think that's the right choice for you. Excellent choice. Okay. I don't know what guns are good and which are not. You need any help? I want the repeating shotgun. Hmm. Size the shopper, I like it. Okay, is that everything I can buy? Oh, I see down there. Gives the stats. Maybe I should have chosen a smaller store in Chinatown. Something cheaper. But I'm sure things will turn around. That's popular around here. do any damage. Okay. <clears throat> huh? Now, I was told now this should be fun. that there... Oh, the question mark. Okay. I was given a clue that there's a side hustle. There. Shit, you know? Let's save. <laughs> Sorry, pal. This is invitation only. What is that matter with you? Hmm. Okay. Relax, my friend. Never mind. So how do I do that though?
Do I have to hold up the shopkeeper? Or is there another entrance? can't see through this rain. Jeez. going to work. I want to see what you got behind that door back there. Now! <laughs> Nothing. This is the back terrace where people go relax and just get away from everything. Let's go in and relax then. Go on, move. Oh, shit's about to go down. Open it up! It's me! <laughs> Must be a slow day. You know how it goes. So there you go. Where else would I be? Yeah, I said. Uh. Hey! What the hell's going on? Wow, the security. What the hell's going on back here? No, nothing. Honest. I'm just paid to guard the place. To guard the back alley? Don't lie to me, you son of a bitch. I just do what I'm told. I don't ask too many questions. All right, you've got three seconds before your goddamn corpse. Three, two. Okay, okay. Take it easy. <sighs> a little poker game, that's all. Third floor, upstairs. Door at the end of the hallway. Just calm down. No shooting. And they ain't paying me enough to care about this. I won't breathe a word to no one. Okay. Gonna leave him. Look, Shit. I only had this job for two weeks. You better stay there. Gotta go greet some people. My perfect honor is tarnished. Third damn floor. Oh. This here's a private event. You'll have to leave. Hey, come on. I got money. What's the buy? You ain't on the list. Leave now, or we got a real. God damn it! Don't be shooting me. Just take it and leave, please. We don't want any trouble. Hmm. Fifty bucks. All there, right. There you go. It's all yours. You just, got anything just in this desk? Home, okay. Yeah, we got a gold nugget. What? Are you kidding me? We're gonna pull an Ezio. We're gonna hide on the roof. I knew I should have hot tagged that asshole. Just gonna hang out. Time to clear out. The law's on it now. Looks like we found the place. Ain't no mistake. We know what they look like. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> 
believe there's nothing here. Don't look on the roof. Assault. I won't stop till you're dead. This is it. Finish them all. How do they see me? Swarm in around them. Get the drop. No, they're not. They're not going after me, are they? Okay, how do I get out of here? Oh, fuck. Well, you know. I might just have to reload. Shit. Siri's just chilling over there. Stay there, girl. Push in on him. Stop goggled and get after him. Sad the knee's gonna cheer at your funeral. I really don't know if they know if I'm up here or not. Take him down. Uh! Oh, okay. That answers that question. Well, we're loading. <laughs> not worth it for $50. Hey there, come on over. I got something here that might be of interest. So, uh, you want to take a look or not? Right here for you when you're ready. Dear sir, the carvings! You found the last of them. Oh wait, until I show you what I've pieced together. Oh. <laughs> well, I haven't got all day. I read good, you guys. Oh, wait until I show you what I've pieced together. That's better. You'll think I'm a bit buttered. Please do not dally. I'm traveling do soon and don't now, want to then? miss you. Or no. See you at my home a bit north of the midway point between Owangila Lake and Strawberry. Yours truly, Francis Sinclair. I really Sinclair. think you want to look at this. Okay, Hector, please shush. All right, suit yourself. I, I don't want it right now. I've got TB. I'm not in the coach robbery mood. <laughs> Run into the trees. Mr. Sinclair? Huh? Oh, hello. Can I help you? Oh, I'm sorry for intruding. Uh, Mrs. Sinclair? Yes. How did you know? I'm looking for your husband. My husband? Yeah. He's dead. He's been dead since just before Francis was born one year ago. No. Your husband, Francis, is dead? No, this is Francis. My husband, Tom, is dead. No! Uh, 
I'm a little confused. Yes, I think you are. What was your name? Uh, uh, that's not important. Excuse me. No, wait. Wait, wait, wait. I want to... I want to look at that wall. Arthur, go back inside. He's not going to let me back inside. Oh, it is. He's a freaking time traveler. Holy shit, that's so cool. Okay, just let me take all this stuff first and then I will look. Had that really cool wall. This is like crazy. This game is so good. What was that movie? Um, the Time Traveler's Wife? It's like the Time Traveler's Mother. I need to clean my weapons. Oh, she's so pretty. And then I'll clean the other ones when I get back out to Siri. I gotta get another Lamotte. There's just so many things to do. Where is that gun oil? Right there. Okay. How to look at this. Let's go first person for this. Why aren't we? There we go. Okay. So he's definitely a time traveler because it looks like he's stepping through a portal of some sort. Kind of looks like the Stargate. He's been to ancient Egypt. We've got some columns there that look very... Can't tell if they look Greek or Roman. I don't know the difference between the columns. I'm not an art historian. All right, and then we've got the pioneers. Looks like we've got some Viking ships. Oh, yep, that's a Viking down there too. him. Is that the different versions of him? Because it looks like there's a little kid head. It looks like different ages if you like look around in the circle and then it ends in a skull. That's kind of cool. We've got New York City, past, current, present, and future maybe? Because that building kind of looks like the Jetsons. <laughs> We've got the Zeppelin at the Empire State Building. We've got rockets and DNA. Planets. Guys, that's so freaking cool.
That was awesome. I'm a fan of that. That was definitely worth all those. Ugh, I don't like that first person. <laughs> Normally I don't mind first person games, but I'm not a fan of it for this game. Okay, let's see. Okay, this needs to be cleaned big time. No wonder my weapons way was so bad. That one could be, but I don't use it a ton. That definitely does. Oh, her saddle's so pretty, you guys. You do not kidnap, ladies. Hey, what? Hey, what? Get me off this Stay there. Was that a raccoon? Quick! Get me free! I'm working on it. Oops. I'm running right by ya. Saving this lady, don't you be judging me. Oh, oh, thank the Lord you showed up when you did. Oh, the things he said he'd do to me. It's all right, ma'am. It's over now. Thank like you. Awkwardly close Again. to her. <laughs> okay, go home, honey. Nice folks around here. Can I bring him in? Hey, mister. This is uh, very kind of you. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm just gonna leave you there. Actually, you know what? Let's bring him. Oh shit! Sorry. <laughs> Making so much noise. Um, I'm going to save it, and then I'm going to bring him to Strawberry. See if I can turn him in. But I'm going to save it just in case people think I'm kidnapping him. Because I don't need to worry about a bounty or anything stupid like that right now. That guy didn't seem to mind. Or was that the girl? I didn't really get a good look.
damn it. Okay. Well. Somebody help me! Here we go. We're just gonna throw you in the bush over here. That's a good home for you. Have fun. I'll pay my bounty at some point, but it's not a priority right this second. I love all of the wildlife, like little birds sitting on the rocks. this looks like an old battleground well, that's it you three back to work we lost too much time on this already oh mr. this is the logging place is unhappy mr appleseed ain't out here getting mauled by wolves we lost two men already what's your good for nothing cowards yeah, yeah. call yourselves lumbermen you afraid of us few damn critters it's a forest what the hell do you expect Partner. Oh, yes, yes. Maybe you're the man I need. Can't you believe these lazy lily livers refusing to work on account of a few little wolves? They've been attacking workers on the south side of the camp. We need a real man to get rid of them. What do you say? You'll be very well rewarded. Sure. All right. If you're paying, I should be able to take care of that for you. <laughs> okay. As always, sidetracked. Focus on the blood. I can't. Also, I should probably, you know, have a gun. It might be helpful. This is the track I want. Okay. Oh, yep, yeah, there's the two little X's I saw on my way down. Oh, Arthur. Okay. 
<laughs> Ouch. Oh god, we're shooting nothing. Oh my god. They're so beautiful. I hate killing them. I kind of wanted to try to keep their pelt intact. <clears throat> intact. But I didn't even check to see what their rating was, so... <laughs> Using my bow was a little stupid. Oh, it is perfect. Yes. Okay, Siri, come here. Hey, girl. Okay, can I get more meat or... Take long. I like how he talks to her. All right, come in. Come Let's on, get out of the rain. From all the gunshots and howling, you got some good news for me? Yep, it's done. <laughs> That's a relief, I'll tell you. Excellent work. Money's right there on the table. Don't mention it. Me and wolves go way back. <laughs> Albert. And a nuisance, brother. Helen, is this creepy little toad bothering you again? Shall I throw him off? This is getting quite out of hand. Hands? Oh, he doesn't. Oh, Arthur, how are you? Never oh, been. brother is right. You see, you two haven't changed much. No, he's still a lizard. Coward, gerbil, mommy's boy. Vanity. Effluent discharge. Milk. Stop. You already said that. Uh, I did not. <laughs> You're a milk sap. Well, you are all chatter and no testes, dear <laughs> brother. Helen, I will make you love me if it's the Helen. last thing I do. And to you need to run now. How suitable I am to make a happy and stable life with. I shall throw myself over the waterfall in just a barrel. And so shall I. Just to demonstrate how little your feeble gestures mean, you homunculus. Arthur, please come do the honors and make sure we, um... Oh, you silly little tapeworm of a man. Follow me! Follow you? I was born first. Helen, I love you. And brother, you're living proof of God's remarkable sense of humor! How about you just leave him in there and walk away? Just for like a couple hours. Then they'll learn their lesson, and Good we'll luck. come back and let them out. Crazy bastard. So I live pretty close to Niagara Falls. People have tried that before. Oh my it didn't Lord. end well. The fools! The silly fools! I cannot believe they've done this! Come on. Well, Let's why didn't you stop them, them, honey? Like, for real. If you said that that wasn't going to win your heart, uh, okay. they, uh, Get on your horse. Follow me. probably wouldn't have done it. They're further down. We won't reach them from here. Do you think they're all right? They might be. You want them to be all right? Of course. Whatever do you mean? 
I was just thinking, it might be easier for you if only one of them was... Catch my meaning? Sir, that is a terrible thing to say. You got a favor? Arthur. I like them both. Equally. Well, maybe fate might help you out. It is not like that, mister. Not like that at all. Sure. I gotta take this wolf pelt to the trapper. How am I supposed to get down there? Can I cut through here? Will she follow me? Oh yeah, there she goes. Okay. Not see. Whoa there. Can I make it down here? Well, we did it. <laughs> here you are. What have you done, <laughs> brother? Are you there, Zachary? <gasps> Is that you? <laughs> I've had the wind knocked out of me. <laughs> I thought you were a goner. <laughs> it's a miracle we're alive. <laughs> silly, silly voice. You nearly died. For me. <laughs> She's right. Oh, dear brother, what fools we've been. You're the fool. But a brave one. You might be dense, but you are the noblest man I know! You are a lion! Giant! You are an earthshaker! World conqueror! Let's Ow. not let anything come between us again. Never. Boys? I, I, Good I, lady, adieu. Bewitch, some other milk sops. Oh. We will have none of it. But I, I thought uh, that... Before this siren calls us to the rocks again, let us away from here. You lead the way, brother. The West awaits. Boys! Boys! <sighs> There's quite some suitors you've picked there. I was trying to stop them from killing themselves. They won't last a week without no, me. Probably not. Well, you'll have an easier time. I guess I will. So long. <laughs> oh my god, after oh, all that. I wasn't trying to lead them on, you know? It was just mm -hmm. exciting. The smartest man I knew, with positively the least sense. <laughs> yeah. Yes, usually the way it works. Good luck. Don't mind me, I'm just picking some cattails. <gasps> no. Tell me that's the KKK right now. before it is too late our numbers are waning thanks to the fools in congress Boo. and their ludicrous ideas Boo. guys they have the kkk but today we grow one yeah. 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 as we Happy. anoint a new brother yeah. into a oh, sacred cause can i kill them yeah. please step forward <coughs> and kneel <coughs> right. sorry do you choose to accept the light? Yes, sir. Can I save before I do anything? 
I kind of want to kill him. Just to see what happens. Does that make me evil or no? <laughs> Does killing evil people make you evil? Vigilante justice? <laughs> I just got on her for that! Oh my god. That's awesome. Who else we got? Who wants them? Damn hooded rodents. I'll kill all you bastards. We got someone on fire running away over there. I love his commentary. Can we loot him? Nope. Meeting notes. Oh, there's blood on them. Quarterly meeting minutes. Six attendees. All official titles to be changed again. Requires new meeting. As the member formerly known as Secretary Senior, I shall now be known as Grandiose Scribe Most. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> My assistant will now be known as Grandiose Scribe Least. Senior Warlock will now be known as Grand Satyr. Other job titles up for discussion at meeting requested above. Job title of Kaiser remains banned as per meeting of August last. Question for open discussion. Is there a way to make the robes less flammable? <laughs> I love it. Acceptable food for Grand Satyr's surprise birthday dinner. French? Possible. Spanish? Definite no. Racist bastards. Membership dues 87% under quarterly target again. Ideas for new initiations need to be canvassed from members. Tarring and feathering was not popular of with wives. Why would you tar and feather your own people? Need to focus on recruitment drive again. Need to find all the brilliant and talented men in the community who have something to give to our cause. Discussion point. Are there any brilliant and talented men left? Not in your ranks. Wooden crosses, heavy and expensive. Other religious symbols to burn as a demonstration of our deep religiosity. Female members? Still affirm no. Still need brilliant and talented men who want to wear hoods and discuss eugenics in their spare time. They should go uh, get that guy from Saint Denis. Somebody needs to review that pamphlet written by Norris Forsyth. Hey, is that the guy from Saint Denis? Has anyone read it? Disappointing attendance numbers again. Members who fail to attend will be punished. Most grandiose scribe. Yep, I punished the lot of ya. Well, that was really unexpected and fun. Are there multiple okay, then, groups of them? Or is that the only one? Because I kind of want to hunt them all down. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to stop there. Um, I did a lot of random things this video. Uh, I might try to do that gunsmith robbery again um, and not get caught, but I'll do that off camera since you have at least seen me attempt it once. Um, and then next video we'll do some more of these side things. I think maybe I'll do a main mission in there. Um, I just need a break from the emotions for a little while. So I did pick up the Strauss stuff. I'm still waiting on that letter from Penelope. 
I have to look into how to get that to trip because I really want to see what that letter is going to ask us about um, or tell us about. But you guys mentioned that I should be getting something, so we'll see. Um, I'm just going to keep kind of going at a slower pace at this point though because I really don't want to miss anything. I really want to try to do the things that you guys have requested and pointed out as well. Um, so I might do a main mission or two next video, but uh, you should expect a slower pace through this chapter. Um, just for my emotional sanity as well as the fact that there's just so much to do. So I hope that you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell button when you do so that you know when I post the next one. And as always, thank you so much for watching you guys. Have a great day.